It is time for the highs and lows of the week, and our first high goes to a bright spot in an absolutely brutal week of summer travel with thousands of flight cancellations across the country. In Oklahoma City, Phil Stringer's flight to Charlotte was delayed for 18 hours. When he showed up at the gate around midnight, Phil discovered he was the only passenger who hung in through the delay, and his American Airlines flight had become a private jet. I am the only person on the plane, and they have an entire flight crew. They do not want to do this flight. <laughs> and loaded all the bags on the plane. How many How many bags do you have to load today, bro? Total of one. <laughs> Passenger Charlie will be leaving in 10 minutes. As the only passenger on the plane, Phil was upgraded to first class. Pick your seat, Phil. And yes, the flight crew performed all of its duties just for him. Meanwhile, in London, Will and Veronica Novak of Arizona walked off of a British Airlines flight to discover later Veronica left her purse and her passport on the plane. Out in the terminal, they flagged down a couple of pilots from a different flight asking for help. After a couple of pilot-to-pilot -pilot text messages, this happened. And they're literally backing away. And that's Veronica's purse coming out the window of the plane. There's Veronica's purse. It's getting dropped down. Amazing. Great play by play there. Yeah, just roll down the window, drop that sucker into the waiting arms of a baggage handler right on the tarmac. A few minutes later, Veronica got the purse, the passport, and a selfie with her heroes. Now that is customer service. Well done, guys. Our first low goes to the frankly substandard speed and grace on display during one race at Emerald Downs Racetrack in Washington State the other day. Let's pick up the heart-stopping action as they come down the stretch. And by they, I mean grandparents. And they're off of the grandparents derby. Oh, we had a spill, another spill. Hopefully everybody is okay. Yeah, we are happy to report despite those spills, everyone in the inaugural grandparents derby at Emerald Downs is okay. The slow motion replay really gives you a clear view of the challenging track conditions. Oof. Steve Butler of Everett, Washington, finished the 40-yard sprint first, though, you know, secretary at the Belmont, he was not. Our next side goes to the Belgian shot putter who stepped into unfamiliar territory to save her team's chances at the European Championships in Poland. Jolien Bumquo usually competes by tossing a heavy ball or a hammer great distances. But when Belgium faced disqualification after two teammates in the 100 meter hurdles had to pull out of the competition due to injury, Bumquo loosened up the legs and stepped into the blocks. There she is at the top of your screen, giving it her best shot against some of the world's best hurdlers. Those hurdles are taller than they look. The 29-year-old kept her team alive, though, just by showing up, finishing the race in 32.81 seconds. She was greeted at the finish line with handshakes and high fives from her competitors. I knew this was a once in a lifetime, so I just wanted to go for it. I don't want to be famous. Um, I just want to be known for my values. Well, now you are. Well done, Yolene. Let's get her in the decathlon. She's not bad. Our final low goes to that feeling when you're home alone, strumming a tune on the guitar, enjoying a moment of peace and reflection in a stressful, chaotic world. But a bird of prey is lurking ominously over your shoulder. Nikki Kundenmal was playing a little acoustic in her living room at home in Los Angeles, while unbeknownst to her, look back there, a hawk had made its way through the open sliding door behind her. As Nikki contemplates the deeper meaning of the classic sixpence none the richer jam kiss me the dog tries to warn her about the bird sit cushy cushy quiet <laughs> Oh no, the hawk takes a few quick nibbles of a snack before the fearsome guard dog chases it back out the way it entered. Nikki and the dog are fine, but Nikki may need a new laptop after she spilled her drink in the chaos. Glad everybody's okay and especially pleased we got the song from She's All That into the show. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.